Hi everyone, welcome to Crea Fun. My name is Maria and today I will be painting beautiful city view. Please subscribe to our channel so we can do more beautiful artwork together. And let's start! So for today's lesson, we will need any type of paint. I'll be using watercolor paint, but you can use actually any media you want. So it can be markers, crayons, anything. Then we'll need a brush, water, and then you can use either a marker or maybe a crayon or a pastel. Um, and let's start, that's pretty much it. And of course we'll need water. Yes. So now let's, let's create our beautiful city view. And I'm gonna start with just a simple line like this. And I'm taking it pretty high, like almost like a little bit above the middle of the paper. And maybe even a little bit higher like this. Then you can decide if you want it to be like straight or uh, maybe angle it a little bit like me now. So I'm gonna do like this. Now you can decide if you want it straight or not. And here we can do anything we want. So there is no right or wrong here. So um, here I'm gonna draw another line. And how about this? I am gonna draw like a line here. I'm gonna connect it like this, right? Now here, I'm gonna bring it like this down, maybe like this. Here we go. Now this one, I wanna bring down, 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 and then maybe angle like this, yes. And you don't need to copy, you can create again the way you want it. Now this one I'm gonna bring down, and now I'm gonna make like some lines, for example. This. So I'm gonna make us three lines. Here we go. Now let's see what we can do here. Like this one, I'm gonna bring it up like this. Now here, why don't I do like a line here like this and then maybe even like this. That's good. Beautiful. Now here I'm gonna do a line like this and add like circles. Here we go. We'll have like a fairy tale buildings. Now, soon it's gonna be a Valentine's Day, so I'm gonna make like a heart. Nice. Then, why don't I make another heart like somewhere here? That's beautiful. Let's see what, what we want to do here. We can add more lines and that's what probably I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna add like line like this and a line like this. Okay. Very nice. Now we have circles here. So I want to make sure that I have them somewhere else. So I'm gonna add them here. That's good. And this one, I want to add like vertical lines. That's good. And I'm gonna do like this. Very nice. And what do we want to do here? I think I just want to separate it and add maybe like another curved line here, just so it's similar here. That's beautiful, look at that. Now the next thing, um, we can decide if you wanted to, to have like a sun here, maybe you want clouds, maybe you want like a moon or stars. You again, you can decide like what you want. And I think I want to add like a few stars. And so I'm gonna add them now. Or maybe if you have like stickers, stars, you can add them later on. That would be very cute as well. Nice, look at that. I think I'm gonna add like a one small one here. It's pretty thick, so it's hard to <laughs> make small stars, but it's all good. So here we go. That's good. And I think I'm gonna add like a small moon here just to add like some details. Here we go. 
That's good. Look at that. So that's beautiful. And I think I'm done with that. If you need more time to create your own version, then please pause the lesson. If not, then let's continue. So now grab your whatever media that you are using. So in my case, I'm using watercolor. So I'm gonna do the, grab that. And I'm gonna start with light colors. And I think I want to start with like yellow and you can pick any area you want. And I think I'm gonna pick like this one and I'm gonna color it. And don't be even afraid if like areas, different areas, they mix together. Well, like in terms of colors, don't worry about it. I think it's all gonna be very pretty at the end. So it's very nice, look at that. And don't forget to add water if you're using watercolor so your brush is not dry. And what I'm gonna be doing, I'm pretty much just mixing like different colors and I want just to add like nice, beautiful tones here. Now what I'm doing, I'm making the paper wet. And this technique is called wet on wet, like painting. So I'm gonna add the watercolor paint now on a wet paper. If you ever feel like there is too much water or too much paint, you can always grab like a paper towel and press it like this. And there we go. Very nice. 
Now this part is dry so I want to add like some more details here and I'm still thinking what to do maybe like small hearts or something else let me see if this one's gonna work there you go but it's it's more like green so I don't want that effect here so I think I'm gonna make like it's like something like this there we go it's nice now here what else we can do here you can do anything like lines dry nice very beautiful very nice so you can add and like as many details if you want and you can even add something on like the heart you can make it more like um, like at stripes or something here I feel like this area is too big like this so I'm just gonna add like lines here on some of them maybe you can do dots you can add like triangles anything you want as i said like this person is very interesting you just keep creating and until it's like oh wow now i'm very happy with it so i like mine now i think it looks beautiful i'm still thinking of adding something here now I'm thinking what that could be. Maybe like a few more hearts or something. That would be nice. Okay, I can turn them in a different direction. Something like that. There we go. Love it. Perfect. Now I'm happy with it. Guys, thank you so much for doing this lesson with me. Please subscribe to our channel so we can do more beautiful artwork together. Thank you.